Hello everyone, and welcome to a different sort of playing by the pound adjacent video. I would more say watching by the pound, I suppose. This is Rollin' Wild. This is a website that has been around for a while. It's actually part of a media series, uh, a series of videos that have expanded into its own little product line, its own little brand. It's very amusing, and I've wanted to talk about it for a while, and now I have a very good reason to talk about it. So. Let's talk about it. Rollin' Wild is pretty cool. Uh, before before we begin, if you like the video, do you think about giving it a like? If you haven't subscribed yet, think about doing that as well. But if you really want to help out, help out, come over to Twitch. We're trying to reach partner over here, but we need more viewers to do that. So if you want to come by, whether it's to lurk or to talk, think about doing so. So it really helps out. We also have a pretty cool Discord community if you want to check that out. And I have a coffee link if you want to help directly monetize my content. All links are in the description, so check them out at your leisure. Also, that's weird. One second. Oh, I see. Huh. How odd. Okay, anyways. My wit up did a weird thing. But anyways, yeah, Rolling Wild. This is pretty cool. Um, it is basically, it started as a little, fill. let's go to the about, about page. I'll start there, actually. So, the about page reads, What if all animals became round overnight? Would their daily life still run that smoothly? This was the question we were dealing with whilst working on the concept for the world of Rollin' Wild, which started life as a series of four clips created at the, oh boy, let's try saying this, Filma Kademi Baden Wurttemberg in 2012. This is a, by the way, these the, the this property is German. Like, the, the people who made it are German. So there's a lot of hard to read German words involved with it. <laughs> When we presented the clips, the reaction was overwhelming, and they seemed to have immediately touched the audience's hearts. We realized that then that four clips wouldn't be enough, and the world was ready for many more spherical animals. With that aim, we, Kyra Bushler and Konstantin Pepo, founded a small company called Flying Stone. At the moment, we are working hard to extend the world of Rollin' Wild, and we hope that we will soon be able to present you with more round animals. Thank you for all your support and patience. Watch this face for the next installment in Rollin' Wild. Kyra and Konstantin. So, yeah, if you can't tell by my avatar at the back of choice, this is very inflation-y based. You can also consider it fat for base based on how you feel about it, but I would say more inflation-y. So, basically, what if world was just everything was inflated and that was world? <laughs> it's a very simple concept, but immensely entertaining and definitely on the, definitely on the, uh, on the focus of uh, what I think playing by the pound audiences would enjoy. But, yeah, let's actually... So, this is a bit different. I don't normally... Uh, watch videos but i will be watching videos and uh the cool thing is that since these are independent films uh as far as i can tell this is fine copyright wise no I, i'm unlikely to get a copyright claim also reaction videos are a thing they're not unusual and we're gonna do it uh so let's let's watch these let's watch these films for starters there is a there's other media besides the films but the films are the main meat of things or the main air of things the opposite of meat nothingness <laughs> inflation a lot of air within within spherical bodies. I don't know. <laughs> Let's watch these though. So it started with Roland Safari, the water hole, uh, which was released FMX 2013. So let's watch. Hold on a second. What quality? Let's go 1080. All the way. All the way. There we go. Zebra. Hmm? Oh no! <laughs> Croc attempted attempted capture failed. <laughs> They're short clips, most of them. I think some of them are a little longer though. I love the animation. Very good animation. These <laughs> this creature says these videos are exactly me. There's a reason I have the plushies in the shirts. Well, it's because I told you about how to get the plushies at a good price. Let's watch the next one. The Chase, 2013 as well. Look at this boy. Defeated. Double kill. <laughs> Clawhauser! <laughs> Double kill! That's extra points. <laughs> So 
So basically, everything starves in this universe because they're too they're, they're too inflated to do anything. I guess. <laughs> All right. Uh, next up, flamingos. Can I click that? Flamingos is not loading. Hold on a second. That one loaded. There we go. Flamingos. Croc is still just drifting around. Which one's the best one in your opinion? I think Croc is best. Croc drowned. Rip. <laughs> they look like cake pops. Yes. <laughs> these videos are just. I just. I. I find these videos very, very charming. Yeah, as far as I can tell, they started in 2013. Like this property kind of started in 2013, but they still get going. They still have been going strong. All right, Sleeping Beauty. These were these were all the 2013 clips they originally had, I think. So, sleep. How did he get up there? Maybe he floated. Huh. Hey, that fly wasn't inflated. If all animals are inflated, that fly should have been inflated too. Just giant bulbous fly bounce. At least when you're inflated, it's okay to fall out of a tree because you're all you just bounce. It's fine. No harm. <laughs> now I think, or this is this a compilation? Let's see. Yeah, this is a compilation of the previous clips. So let's go to the next set. Now, these are the ones they made later, I think. Started to make later, maybe a year or two later. Vulture. I haven't I have not actually seen anything past what we just saw. Oh god. <laughs> They're so ugly. <laughs> Balls. Oh, no more flesh balls. <laughs> the premise is that this all happens. To, oh, is it, is it a world that wasn't inflated and then it was? Oh, is that the premise? Okay. So the the inflation virus hit the world. Ah, Christmas video. Good. Very good. Thank you, Public Domain Christmas Music. I blame Creature. <laughs> oh, there it goes. Inflation ruined Christmas, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> this is the German version of this song, I just realized, because again, German property. So, <laughs> German version of that song. I've never heard a German version of that song. That's kind of nice, actually. Um, <laughs> Alright, Rolling Wild Meerkat, sure. Let's see. Very good. Yeah, that didn't work out. <laughs> Bounce. Oh no, the, the wild dog camera's been hit. <sighs> watch out for the vulture. <laughs> watch out for the vulture. It can't fly straight, but watch out. <laughs> Very good. Okay, another Christmas one, which I assume they did the next year after or something. I don't know exactly when all these released. Probably could look up the actual YouTube pages for that, but I don't care that much. Please load. Oh, this one's in 360. Let's see if I can get it to load, though. There we go. Sometimes the videos don't load right. So this one... Yeah, I can move this one around. Look at that. It is kind of played by the pad. I can move the camera around. Now it's a game, right? That, that counts for a game. Oh my god, it goes to 1440. I'll just leave it to me. This is technically a game at this point. This is a story that's often been told. It began on a night that was silent and cold. 
three shepherds they sat in the warm firelight. No sound had been heard throughout the long night. The clouds parted above them, and heavenly light shone down on the three who were frozen with fright. An angel flew down and appeared to them all. He came on a mission, a heavenly call. Spoke then the angel, and they all understood. In his voice there was wisdom, and all that was good. You should get Esther for so this. Bursting with courage, not heeding their plight, they hurried to Bethlehem through the cold, silent night. Oh. Sheep is destroyed the nativity scene. This holy announcement <laughs> was followed again by elderly fellows we call the wise men. They were led by a star that appeared in the sky. Through the desert, <laughs> a sign from on high. Through the valleys and mountains and dunes made of sand, they journeyed away from their own native land. But the star lit the night with a wondrous glow and pointed the way to the marvel below. They traveled for days without any rest and finally reaching the place that was blessed, they found a poor stable so humble and bare but it housed a small miracle slumbering there. <laughs> the stands looks pretty empty in the theater. It's just me. So now, not a very they popular show. They draw back the veil to a magical scene, the end of our tale, a miraculous birth that happened that night. No one dared to disturb it. All was silent and quiet. They gazed at the new rampaging sheep problems. Lay, sleeping so soundly in the warmth of the hay, they huddled together, all out of the chill, enjoying the moment. Standing silent and still. Very good. Thus ends the story. Our seasonal play. We wish you a happy and peaceful holiday. Merry <laughs> like, Christmas. <laughs> and a happy New Year. I, I like the Stanley Parable reference. Yeah, it does kind of sound like the same guy. It might even be the same guy. I don't know. <laughs> the Stanley Parable guy. Uh, <laughs> did he possibly? Start voicing this. Do other voice. I mean, I assume he does other voice work. He's got a good voice. <laughs> also, uh, lol, despite its routers, it continued. Yeah, it's not fat, it's inflated. But uh, granted, they are trying to eat a lot of these guys. <laughs> have I played this? No, I have not played the Stanley Parable, actually. Uh, but yeah, if you didn't know, 360 videos is a thing. Uh, there are a thing on YouTube where you, you could actually rotate the seat around and look at other directions and stuff. Like, yeah. That is a thing. They're kind of almost games when you think about it. You just drag on the screen and you can just move it around. It's kind of cool, isn't it? They're not very common, but they exist and they can you can make them, obviously. Um, I feel like somebody could do something really cool. I feel like somebody could do a YouTube, could actually make a game on, on a set of YouTube videos using 360 scenes. Imagine having to rotate the scenes and like look for something that lets you know where to go next or something. Like actually have to find something, looking around. That'd be kind of interesting. Anyways, next video. Giraffe. Very good. V very good. He's a, he found some food. It drafts even more inflated than most of them. Uh oh. That's this is problematic. <laughs> you're gonna die of thirst, now you're gonna die of too much water. <laughs> These poor animals. <laughs> Alright, Roland France. Okay, here's a different. Like, all these other. Aside from the Christmas ones, these have all been Savannah. But this one, uh, I guess on the later videos that they more recently made, which I believe. Actually, let me double check this. Uh, well, this video was made. in 2016. Okay, that's what I thought. Um, 2016 for that one, which. Uh, I think these later ones. I think France here. I think this is a much more recent one. Let me check that. Yeah, 2017. A little more recent. Like, they're not making videos quickly, per se, but they are definitely releasing them as time goes on. So, this is probably, will probably continue to grow. Or expand. Or inflate. <laughs> Puns. Anyways, let's do World Fla France.
Good. Pop up. Expand dog. Lovely. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> Good work. <laughs> Oh, no, not the gerbil. Oh, no. Oh, good. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> well, we have a we have an ungulf. Oh, good cows. Very good. They do that even when not round. This is true. They gotta be careful with those horns, they're gonna pop- oh goodness me. They're really packed- <laughs> still rolling! Really rolling wild. We have Essler and Ungulf, so far so yeah. Whoa, that was quite a bounce. Hey, are you okay? I know we were like, knocking horns, but... Pigs are good. <laughs> that was a long one. Still rolling. <laughs> I like how the owner's like, well, he's just gonna be doing that. I'm just gonna turn the lights off. <laughs> what a what a wonderful thumbnail, by the way. <laughs> what a what a graceful thumbnail. Uh, <laughs> so uh, Rain, you're having desync. Does anybody else have a desync? It shouldn't have it. There shouldn't be any desync here. Um, <laughs> nobody else is complaining. So Rain, I would suggest refreshing. Desync can happen with uh, Twitch sometimes if you just you just need to refresh. Uh, all right, rolling mountain goat. I think this is the last one they've made so far. Is that just the one we just saw, or <laughs> yeah, reload? It just reload if it does that. If you have desync after reloading, mention it. Oh boy, this isn't very safe. Mountain goats do some crazy climbing, but this is very safe for one that's this, this inflated. If you didn't know, mountain goats can climb basically a sheer cliff. <laughs> They're pretty crazy. I don't know how they do it with hooves, of all things. <laughs> really, really, really plenty of this. Alright, alright, alright. Just uh, calculate the distance. Nope. <laughs> I do like that these are filmed like a nature documentary. Like that, the camera movement there was like, was like a nature documentarist. Documentaryist. Is that a word? Just like filming the scene and then like adjusting. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, so... <laughs> Mountains can climb dams. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. They have, clo they have like, split hooves, right? That probably is why they can get better balance. Alright, so that's all the major videos. Though there is this. Yay. Actual plushies. Incidentally. Yeah, so they, they started selling these, I think, pretty recently. Oh, oh let's see. What, what was they start? They, they put these out. Yeah, la, la, Chris, uh, Christmas. They put it out around last Christmas, so. Pretty recently, all said. Uh, <laughs> but yeah. So, here's the fun thing you can get on the shop page here. So those are the videos. You can see why the property is cute and fun and why I wanted to check it out. Uh, yeah, you can get plushies. They also have had shirts for a while and other stuff. I don't really know exactly what's here. 
they got yeah sure whatever agree i don't care just let me look <laughs> uh but yeah like different t-shirt designs and stuff which is cool this is a very just very good logo don't they have like i, I really feel like it's a good logo <laughs> but uh aside from that they also they are very active on facebook which i don't really use but why is this broken whatever <laughs> what wait what's this <laughs> Was this like a vote your favorite? <laughs> ah, I see. Vote for your favorite animal that they have basically inflated out of all the uh, out of all the animals they've inflated. Crocodile one. Crocodile one. Good. <laughs> so now he's a disco ball. So it looks like crocodile, cheetah, leopard, giraffe, zebra, cat, cow, flamingo, meerkat, hamster, bulldog, pig, seal, reindeer, sheep, gazelle. Ibex, Vulture, Mouse, and Vulture Chicks. <laughs> vulture Chicks is the worst one, so I'm not surprised it's at the bottom. But it's, it's bad. It's so bad it's good in a way, so kind of works. <laughs> oh, Esther's going to be sad the sheep is so low. <laughs> uh, let's see here. So yeah, sur it was a survey they did. Media's not available. We well, I can see it there. Weekend plans. That's a good weekend plan right there. I can agree with that. Rock. <laughs> but here's the here's the thing too um so i guess they also have wallpapers available if you just want to yeah if you just want to have a really silly wallpaper your desktop which you know why wouldn't you <laughs> oh they also have concept art of some creatures we haven't seen in that mate like a chameleon very good i feel like a chameleon could still eat because of the tongue thing i feel like he'd, they'd be okay with that but uh Pretty amusing, but here's the cool thing, right? So they have a shop. They have they were selling t the t-shirts and cups and stuff for a while, but the plushies are a new thing, a uh, pretty recent new thing. So the cool thing is, I have uh, if you haven't figured it out by now, part of the reason I'm doing this video is that it was it was very convenient to do this with the other th video because. Both of them require the webcam. So why not do them together? Where the heck is my webcam feed? I have lost it. Where did it go? Do, 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 do. Okay, I lost my webcam feed for some reason on this. That's okay. I will add it back. Do, 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 do. There. Webcam. I'm not even showing the box, dude. Relax. We're all good. We're all good here. But yeah, so let's let me demonstrate uh, that I have a thing because I want to. As soon as I get this feed set up, sorry about this. I don't know what why the, the webcam feed was deleted on this tab. Shouldn't have been, but it was. Okay, that should do. All right, so <laughs> yeah, uh, <laughs> geez, Louise. Um, so I didn't order every plush that they actually weren't that expensive, but I ordered this guy. And my goodness, there's two sizes you can order them in. I forget the exact centimeters, but I got the bigger one. And guys, this guy is big. I'm I, I'm trying to think of how I could demonstrate how big he is. Uh. Oh, you know what? Hold on a sec. I know exactly how I can. I need a, I need a relative object. And what better way to demonstrate with a can of soda? Something that everybody knows the size of, just to demonstrate. <laughs> This works out perfectly. Also, who knows? Maybe the carbonation got to. But yeah, like so. If we compare the size of this can to him, you can see the size of this guy is pretty freaking big. Uh, he is not small. That's just me putting him side by side like this, like so. So, yeah. This is. <laughs> it's kind of. Uh, I'd say it's about the size of a volleyball. 
uh, which is not small. Maybe just a little bit under. And my goodness, look at him. I, look how the eyes kind of point in two different directions, but that kind of just makes it better, actually. <laughs> um, but yeah, I really appreciate this plush. It, it's very... It's very... It's very... There's a lot of stuff fit in here. It's not just... You know, it's not just, like, kind of airy. It's actually pretty well stuffed. It is well stuffed. Got these little tiny legs. But I really appreciate, especially the... Uh, I can show it off. You can kind of see it. Yeah, you can kind of see there. Uh, the scaly texturing to his top. Which is very good, actually. <laughs> he is just reflecting the light just <laughs> so much because of his shape. But yeah, it's, it, I really... Yeah, it's quite a good plush. Quite a well-made plush. <laughs> very happy to have this. What a conversation piece to, like, put on a shelf or whatever, you know? Like, honestly, this guy. <laughs> it's so good. But yeah, Uni Toys is where I recommend buying from. It does come from Germany. Actually, it only took like a week to get here. And given the price was not that much and it was coming from Germany, I'm very impressed. Yeah. Like, it says that there it's coming from Germany. But um, yeah, this, this, very affordable, I'd say, for especially for what you get. This thing is huge, like I said. So, very fun plush. Gave me an excuse to cover the Roland Wild uh, media <laughs> to gain this plush as well, and uh, yeah. So the, they sell the uh, they sell the they sell the crocodile, they sell the cheetah, and they sell the mountain goat. So I chose the best one. I feel <laughs> so where our crocodile is the largest reptile, especially especially uh, like now he's even now he's even larger. Hooray! <laughs> Throw it at Aragon. <laughs> Aragon was not amused. Aragon was just like, why does that exist? When I showed it to him, he was just like, why? <laughs> that's exactly why. Because why? <laughs> but yeah, so uh, that's kind of the entirety of the Rolling Wild property up till now. They'll probably make more videos in the future. And if that happens, I might... Uh, well, probably won't act I probably won't cover them a second time, but do watch out. They have a YouTube channel. You can check out their page, Rollin' Wild. It's, uh, I think it's, uh, what is it called? Rollin'-Wild.com. Rollin'-Wild.com if you want to check them out. Uh, but yeah, very fun property. Think about, if you, if you like inflated animals, maybe think about picking up one of their plushies uh, if you want to. They're, again, they don't they don't actually cost that much. And they, it, I can verify that they ship fine, so. But yeah, that was, uh, that was Rollin' Wild. Let me just end this on a good wallpaper like that one, obviously. Very good. That was Rollin' Wild. <laughs> Go check it out if you like inflated things. And who doesn't, right? <laughs> Especially in this crowd. <laughs>